Does Bitcoin matter? Does Bitcoin care? What do you think about it, whether it matters or not? Well, the President of the United States believes that Bitcoin indeed matters. Um, he labeled it a potential threat to the national security of the United States of America. I don't think that Bitcoin cares about what the President of the United States thinks about Bitcoin. And this is kind of the point. For thousands of years, the way that we designed money was such that what people thought about that particular kind of money influenced the money and the behavior of that money and the rules under which that money would be able to exist. The point of Bitcoin and the design principles of Bitcoin start from being able to decouple from whatever anyone thinks about it and it doesn't matter if they are the President of the United States. When Bitcoin was born, just a few people believed in the experiment or dedicated time and energy to understand what the Bitcoin experiment uh, would be about. Today, Bitcoin arrived at a point where the heads of the most powerful nations in the world believe that they cannot afford not to take Bitcoin in serious consideration. So what will be the next step? The next step is that Bitcoin will still not care. Bitcoin will still do its own thing. The network that will enable anyone to transfer value in an unfettered manner and without any possibility of nation states stopping it or organizations interfering. The European Union, uh, for example, uh, is the latest to delude themselves that they will be able to stop uh, Bitcoin. Uh, the European Parliament voted a few weeks ago uh, a resolution that will be implemented in all the member states that will impose reporting requirements on Bitcoin exchanges that are stricter than not those imposed on any bank. A bank is required to uh, report on the source and the destination of a transaction when it is larger than the equivalent of $10,000 or 10,000 euro. The rule that is now going to be imposed in Europe is for this reporting to apply at any amount being transferred. And it is frankly ridiculous. And it is not going to achieve whatever supposed desired effect the legislators felt they would need to act in order to achieve. Why? Because Bitcoin doesn't care. So, these conferences like Bitcoin 2022 here in Miami are an interesting mix of grassroots enthusiasm, of punditry, of technology companies um, providing different kinds of solutions, 
And uh, well, yes, Bitcoin doesn't care even about that. These uh, um, conferences are a, a, a wonderful way for the community to uh, find each other and recognize each other and also to distinguish itself from other communities. At Bitcoin 2022, for example, it is frowned upon to talk about anything other than Bitcoin. You are not supposed to mention Ethereum. You are not supposed to mention cryptocurrencies. And it is um, uh, very sweet how the Bitcoin community wants to distance itself uh, from uh, these other communities too. Of course, important uh, in order to maintain its own identity, in order to uh, support its own perceived importance. And guess what? Bitcoin doesn't care. So this kind of ability of not caring is uh, rather unique but it is not unique in the sense that uh, we don't see it in other systems it's just that we don't see it in systems that are designed by humans this kind of uncaring reliable robust functionality is universal in natural systems uh, when we look at a documentary uh, where, for example, a newborn uh, antelope uh, is uh, eaten by a lion, we project our human values and our human emotions in what is happening. And we feel bad for the antelope uh, uh, that dies after a few hours or days of being born but nature actually doesn't care nature just does its own thing so in this sense Bitcoin is the first human designed system that truly resembles this ability of performing its function that we can recognize and attribute to natural systems and it will be very important for everyone to understand this both uh, those who have been in Bitcoin for a long time those who are now recognizing it for the first time and regulators and nation-states as powerful as they perceive themselves to be they will have to come to grips that the performance and the robustness and the ability to uh, keep going in the future of Bitcoin is independent from their desires, is uh, going to happen regardless of what they think or what they do. You should care and uh, I I'm looking forward to understanding that you are caring, but you should care for yourself and be uh, fine with the fact and recognize your ability to let go of the feelings that you have towards Bitcoin, because Bitcoin doesn't care.